welcome to the video. Jump on in, you're riding with Steel City Storm. As you can see, I wanted to start off right here as reference point, 41st Avenue, we're going to the west side. The last video I did was the east side, uh, 41st Avenue. So we're gonna be heading down the west side. Broadway, I'm turning out, there's the old fire station. As you can see, the conditions are a little rough over this way. At least that's a one way street, so that's Washington Street. So I want to cover them. I'm going to go from here, from Broadway to Grant. I'm going to zigzag up a couple blocks. This way it won't be long or drawn out, and we can also do it in different sections. You know what I'm saying? So let's turn down this street, get back down Washington. I'm going to go to uh, 43rd in Washington and zigzag up and down the blocks. So enjoy the ride, and uh, I'll try not to talk you too much. Let's enjoy the video. And I'm trying to show the surroundings without swinging the camera. I've been working on that. I really have. It's important to me that to see. Wow. Well, um. You know, the wife, and she'll look at someone, she'll say, baby, moving the camera too fast, or slow down, or something like that. And I listen, or people say it on videos, you know. But I think I've been doing a lot better. That's usually with the exploring thing. As far as the driving video, I said before, I have my elbow sitting here in the van, just chilling, and not really watching my phone as I'm recording. That's what I'm using is my iPhone. That's what I record with this convenient Christ Temple. Um, yeah, this is Washington Street. So we'll go down here to 41st and we're gonna zigzag our way west towards Grant Street, all right? All you people out there from Gary, Indiana who are just interested in it, or whatever the reasons may be that you watch the channel, I'm very proud that I've built up such a wonderful um, bunch of people that believe in what I do and they 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 see the, the importance of documenting these places and that's what I'm just trying to do you know there's the back of the old fire station and uh, you know that it's, it's just that simple and like I said I've been trying to cut up the, the driving videos where they're not an hour long um, but I just kind of concentrate on different sections because a lot of people when I was doing some of them would tell me their address and I felt bad that I didn't go up and down that street so this way I think I can cover more streets um, like I said we've worked our way from all the way downtown okay we're gonna go south and we're on Adams Street you know I've worked my way from both sides of Broadway all the way up, up and down these back roads and uh, I plan on doing some more I actually have a big surprise coming for you guys I know this is the street we came up the first time but I gotta get back and on track and that is I'm gonna have my mom was born and raised out here in Cary too and she has so many memories so many tales that I'm sure a lot of the older generations such as myself can relate to and want to hear it, the old names of people she knows everybody been in Gary our whole life you know and uh, I love my city, and that's why I'm doing what I do. I think it's important to document these uh, these videos, you know, not because they're like, oh my God, I can't believe how spectacular this video is. No, I'm not going for that. I'm going for doing something that gives back a little bit to the community, and people are interested in watching because I felt if I was interested in seeing it, that other people would, and that's kind of where the whole thing started from, you know? So... I, I love I love uh, riding around looking. Wow, look at this mess. I gotta go by here. Look at those houses. That one's nice. Look at that nice house. <sighs> look at that. Hey. That was a nice crib one time. It's a nice house over here. That church though, that church is awesome. that house wow okay we're back on washington street hope you like the ride around because i'm 
it's definitely uh, one that take you riding around. Now, right there, there was about two other houses, and they tore them down. That's actually they found a body of one of the serial killers. I don't want to talk. I don't want to say his name. You know who it is. But right there, they found a body. Yeah, he took him to him and showed him. That's where it was. We actually did the explore uh, before all that happened. And uh, we've been in and out of these uh, these empty spots. You know, you can't help but be curious of what's left inside. I mean, look how they sit. Look at that. They just sit just like that. You know, look at that one. You know, in the corner store. This is important to document for one reason or another. And that's why I'm going to do what I do probably forever. All right. <laughs> Sorry, that's just, that's this past mine. This is 42nd Washington. And I'm just riding around Babylon. We've already been down the street, but I'm just gonna give you guys, and uh, give you guys a, a view, kind of how you see it. It's an overcast kind of day, and it's Friday afternoon as I'm filming this, and there's a lot of people out and about, so. Now we get on track because I had to go back and cover Washington Street. I couldn't skip it, you know. I thought they were pretty interesting street, actually. Then we got Adams Street here, and we went up and down that one. Now I'm gonna go down here, go up a couple blocks, and zigzag our way back. Okay, that's that's the game plan. Might get off track here every now and then, but I mean, there's no script here. You know, you're just riding along, car ride. I'm holding and recording and uh, trying to stay safe. You know, you gotta watch yourself riding around any place, especially out here. People drive crazy everywhere, but yeah. We'll just skip that street. I was, I'm not sure what street that even was, but we'll just skip that so I can get back on track. I need to zig, zig south, because we gotta go all the way down to Grand Street. And, uh, and there's some other homes that we did explore on a corner shop. This is Madison. 41st in Madison here. Hello. Hmm. You know, and there's not there's nice parts of Gary too. I want to emphasize that. There is, there really is. You know, don't don't be mistaken that, you know, Gary, Gary's not a wonderful place to live. You just got to watch how you move. And, uh, you know, you got to sometimes um, just remember, you know, some places don't have it as good as your city or your state or wherever you're at now. You know, and we all have our opinions of why that happens. I mean, what is the reason behind us? Look at that. Do you see that? Do you see that? And that's a nice house. That wasn't no, just a little piece of junk house, you know. Right. Some more how band is right there. I just couldn't imagine living in the street with, looking at that, that's terrible. I feel bad. I feel bad when I come up and down some of these streets sometimes. You know, this one's a very so deep, you can't see it. And there's banded ones. Look at that. Sure to leave your comments, you know. People, there's there's a way to get to your point, and I don't. I'm not saying because it's happened, because the subscribers on the channel are just, you know, fantastic. I mean, they're some of the best people ever. They really are, you know. And I take that. I'll take the handful of good ones over the millions of, or hundreds of thousands of just people who just, you know, they don't really care about what you're doing. These people that are on the channel, they care. And that makes me have the passion just to do this. I mean, the channel doesn't get a lot, you know. I, I don't make a lot, a lot of money off this stuff at all. Trust me. Minus gas money too. Give me a break. No, you know. Be lucky if I could clear over a couple hundred bucks. To be honest with you. I don't know if you, misconception of it, but you know, I also have a full time job, and I just enjoy putting this out there. It makes me feel like I'm doing something, you know. I'm not quite sure there's a sole purpose. Check that out. But, you know, I just think that there's some kind of importance to it. And uh, people have really been getting interested in talking to me lately about these things. And 
you know, I'm no expert on it. I just enjoy looking at things that bring back memories for me. And it could be something that's not even there anymore, just a spot, just a piece of the sidewalk, but it does something for you. I mean, if I was, if you see some place that you used to go that you haven't thought of for a long time, and it sparks a good memory, I get a lot of comments that people say, oh, my grandmother took me here when I was a kid. I remember shopping there. My dad used to work there. We owned there. I used to work there. That was my first job. I love that stuff. And that right there is the fuel that keeps this fire going. So just remember that. You're, you know, you're very important to me. I can't obviously reach out and speak to everybody, you know, but if, if we could, you know, and doing live streams like that, you know, it's just not my not my thing but I'll get back to doing them I have a studio set up and everything I've just been so busy with so many other things in life you know I get out here and ride around on my time okay we're going down Jackson Street alright sell it, whatever, the license, whatever, I mean, there's got to be a way around that stuff, where it's not fair to the people, like, look, look at the kids out here, see them out here, there's children out here that, that, it's <sighs> irritating sometimes, I'm sorry, these children shouldn't have to look at this, and I stand behind my words, I say what I said, and I'll argue, fight with anybody about that. Us grown ups are responsible for surrounding these kids with some kind of nurturing environment or support or special places to go that they can call their own and it's like a gift to us from us to them, you know. Boys and girls clubs and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, they're around, but you know, there's not enough out there for these boys and girls to do. And it is what it is. I'm not preaching about that, okay, I'm not, um, is it dead end, it's a dead end up here, I hope not, I'm not preaching about that stuff, okay, don't get me wrong, I'm preaching for the kids, you know, I couldn't imagine having my beautiful children playing outside with abandoned buildings around, oh boy, I don't like this, this is good. I'm gonna put the phone down, I gotta turn around real quick. <laughs> 